today I will make a hole in a wall of sand. In reality, it's not just a hole, but a porthole, which I will use for a special effect in two videos. If you watch this video to the end, you will understand. I am in Understed, Denmark, in the sand sculptor park, and the sand is amazing, super strong and fine, is perfect. Almost, almost, little bit more. Ah, finally the light. I forgot to tell you, it's quarry sand. I need one little help. Uh, thank you, thank you, perfect. I can try also by myself. I like this system to jump to the hole, nice. I spray water mist to make the sand stickier. With the spatula, scratch the surface to make the connection easier and uh, use very wet sand to make the edge of the portal. Always with the very wet sand at the rivets of the portal. Smooth everything with a spatula and your portal is finally ready. And now you can apply very wet grey sand to color Tintin's rocket. It looks like uh, unbelievable, but it's the same sand washed 10 times. Washing the sand many times, you eliminate almost all the silt that has a more yellowish color and in the end you get an uh, almost white sand. You can only do this with a quarry sand. The sand you will get, however, has a problem. When it dries, it crumbles very easily. Be careful! And this is the final result which I used for the special effects in two videos. Tintin's rocket flies to the moon and the Captain Nemo's Nautilus. Close the door. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Aliens, we are coming. I have to go out and free the Nautilus. Four stories that you can see at the Sand Sculptor Park in Unst, Denmark. Bye and see you soon!